I read about it on the internet when I was looking up prostate cancer. I heard about it from Dr. Kella because uh, I was hesitating on getting the uh, prostate removal surgery. And uh, Dr. Kella mentioned that there was a procedure called Tulsa Pro. And um, I did a little research on it too, and I decided that was the way I wanted to go. When I was looking on the internet and reading uh, and uh, reading some information on Tulsa, the percentages of people that that had good outcomes and that had didn't have any side effects like uh, with uh, incontinence seemed to be lower than any other procedure that I, I read about. So uh, that's what why I decided to go with them. I was uh, looking on the internet and uh, came across this uh, forum uh, for people that have uh, prostate cancer, and uh, they um, that's where I, I did some. They had some articles about uh, Tulsa Pro and other procedures, and uh, testimonials from people that had gone through uh, and are going through prostate cancer, and read read about uh, some more information on Tulsa Pro there. Because Tulsa Pro is a new procedure, the um, I was actually the first one in San Antonio to have it done. Uh, some people call it a surgery, but I, but I never, I never did. I call it a procedure because you know they didn't cut me, and I was asleep by the time anybody started doing anything. So uh, I basically just woke up and it was done, and I wasn't in any pain before or after. It's just dealing with the the, the uh, catheter, which. It's so not a lot of pain. I didn't. I, I never took any painkillers. Maybe a Tylenol once in a while. But it's the inconvenience of having a catheter. Two weeks is what I would have it for. Post procedure, you did take it easy for for uh, for a couple of weeks afterwards. But I was able to get around the house fine. I mean, uh, after that, uh, going to the bathroom, you know, going to the kitchen, uh, stuff around the house. I didn't need any assistance. Suppose uh, the person could could go to work if they didn't have a too physical a job. I only needed some medications a couple of times. I mean, I'm, literally, I took a handful, maybe four or five Tylenol, and not I would just take one, maybe a day. Because uh, sometimes with the uh, the catheter, you have some uh, burning sensation mostly, and uh, as, uh, after a week, maybe some aching. Other than that, no painkillers. I was able to go to the groceries and go to Walmart, but uh, I wasn't staying out all day. And just really taking it easy. My overall experience with Dr. Keller was good. The radiology place, uh, a good place, and the people are nice and, and treated me well with respect. As of now, I would recommend the procedure to other patients. I would do the Tulsa Pro again if, if necessary, or in hindsight, looking back, I think. Of course, time will tell, but I think I made the right decision. I say time will tell because with cancer, you have to uh, be tested periodically, see how your PSA numbers are. And hopefully uh, my numbers will be low and they'll stay low. And hopefully one day the doctor will say I'm cancer free.